In this video, we're going to learn the treble crochet. Building on what we learned from the double, let's begin. Before you begin any row of treble crochets, you always chain four stitches first. Once you have those four chained, you're going to yarn over with your hook twice. There's two yarns over. Now, take your hook and insert it in the next stitch. Yarn over and pull through. And that's going to leave you with four loops on your hook. Now you're going to yarn over and pull through two. That leaves you with three. Now you're going to yarn over and pull through two again. That leaves you with two loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through those two loops. You can see this stitch has three parts to it. So yarn over twice. Don't forget to do it twice. Insert your hook in the next stitch. Yarn over and pull it through. That leaves your four loops on the hook. So yarn over and pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over and pull through two. That's three parts to the stitch. And you can see how much taller the stitch is than the double or the half double or the single. So yarn over twice. Insert your hook. Yarn over and pull through. Now two at a time, you're going to yarn over and pull through those first two. Now again, you're going to yarn over and pull through the next two. And to finish it off, yarn over and pull through the last two. Continue working this all the way down just as we do it all the stitches. Yarn over twice. Insert your hook, yarn over and pull through. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. And again, yarn over, pull through two. So just watch this a couple of times. Just remember the stitches are always worked in pulling through two loops at a time. That gives you the three parts of the treble crochet. Pulling through the first two, the second two, and the last two. Always remember to yarn over twice. Insert your hook in the next stitch. Yarn over, pull through. Four loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through the first two. Yarn over, pull through the next two. And yarn over, pull through the last two. Work this all the way to the end of your chain, remembering to pick up that last stitch. Pulling through two loops at a time, finish it off with the last two, and this is what your row of treble crochets look like.